Hey, so today we're out here. This is my cousin, Matt. He's got a YouTube channel, which I will link somewhere on the screen. Right there, <laughs> right there. Uh, what's the name of your channel, Matt? It's just Matt D. Matt D. <laughs> so go check his channel out and subscribe and you'll see more of what we're gonna do today. Where are we at, Matt? We are at uh, Walnut Hills Park in the city of Dayton, Ohio. It's about two blocks from my house. Um, the reason why we're here is because it needs mowed and the city of Dayton only mows it maybe four or five times a year. And um, this grass is not very tall compared to other parts that you'll see us mowing. Um, but you can't enjoy a park when you're, when you're hut trudging through a hay field, basically. Matt does a lot of uh, helping out of the community and uh, it's really, really pretty cool. Um, yep. Takes a lot of work on his side. And so I'm kind of happy to come out and help him out a little bit. Yeah, I would have been over here anyway, so just him showing up <laughs> is a bonus. So yep. anyway, not, enough of us, enough of us uh, yammering. We're, We're going to get started. Get started. Get you in on the action. We got two Honda mowers. This one here is a quadra cut twin blade system. It was given to me for free. This one's um, got the smart drive system. Smart drive. This is just regular self-propel. It's an older mower, but it works great. Yep. It'll, it'll have no problem handling this grass here. Some little girl might miss that, or boy, who knows? Gotta be politically correct. So, so far, we got a lot of this mode up here, especially by the playground equipment, which really what matters is kids come into this neighborhood and this uh, park, and uh, they mostly play around that. Some of the open areas, like as you get farther out, not widely as used, so we're probably not gonna get all of this up here. It's really about taking care of the places that the people actually use. So now back here, we're kind of by the tennis courts. We're gonna get all this tamed here. Mother Nature forced us to take a little break here because we were mowing down the hill and all of a sudden, Matt's pointing to these uh, clouds. We weren't sure if it's haze or clouds and then all of a sudden comes in and it's just dropping buckets of water on us. Yeah. How, ma how many acres do you think the park is? Do you have any idea? The, um, this park, I believe, is about eight acres maybe eight. Uh, you see the disaster mess that I have become um, 
<clears throat> with the uh, grass being as tall as it is, my mower has continuously clogged up, so I had to prop open the the bag catcher thing so it shoots out, and unfortunately, I'm the victim of that. How long have we been mowing? All in all, with start and stop and a half hour of break, so probably three hours of mowing is what we've done. Yeah. Um, you have other, are there other people in the neighborhood that ever come to help you, or do you just do it by yourself? Usually, usually it's just me. You're taking care of the community. Uh, well, I'm doing the city job without getting paid for it. With as much rain as there's been, like it grows quick, and that, like the grass was heavy, like it's thick grass. Yeah, it's not ideal grass to mow with push mowers, um, but it's yeah. whatever. I mean, we have we make it work. We've got these two Honda mowers, and they're like these are nice. These are really nice mowers, but even they were struggling in the grass as thick as it was. Yeah, and they're set up. Uh, they're set up higher than I would mow my own lawn. Yeah. Just because of the, um, just the height because of, of the grass. the height of the grass. And so uh, they're still struggling, so that's why I propped open the back to try to help the grass uh, discharge from the mower quicker. It's going out the side that I've propped up, and then it's going out the back as well. It's, and it's been just mowing through everything. I think we're done. I'm wore out. I'm pretty tired. Still a lot more left to cut, but we're pretty done. But you gotta keep in mind, if it doesn't seem like a lot, it's because this grass mostly was eight to 10 inches tall, and that's no joke. Yep. Um, so some places had to, we had to go over it twice. That's why I'm covered in this. This stuff, this stuff was no joke. Uh, the, the city owes Matt some money. That's not gonna happen, but they should pay me. <laughs> Oh well. Anyway, hope you uh, hope everyone enjoyed watching. We had fun making the video, uh, regardless of the look on our faces at the moment. <laughs> <laughs> I'm more out. Yeah, we're, we're done. You ever have people at the park that thank you for what you're doing, or do they just take it for never, granted? Never. I've I've never had anyone. That's kind of messed up. <laughs> I've never I've never had anyone come and thank me. They see me picking up trash. Um, the basically the only thing I've ever had someone say to me picking up track I mean there's been one or two people that say thanks but mostly it's like when I'm, I'm going around the neighborhood picking up trash I don't know how you do it and my response is I'm tired of looking at it <laughs> so I, I think like you're doing a good job out here for the community you're uh, you're working with everything you have. There are some tools that you're missing. Yeah. So I think like you know, if anyone's watching and you feel gracious and you want to donate to the cause, um, how, what's the what's the best way? Like say nothing. We don't send it, set anything else up. <laughs> PayPal. Uh, I've, I've never used so, PayPal okay. in my life. So so I've got PayPal. 
If, I, you, if you want to donate something, send it to my PayPal and I'll send it to Matt. And the PayPal I'll list in the description. I'm, I'm really looking to just get a real nice trimmer, commercial grade, nothing you can buy at Lowe's or Home Depot. There's uh, th the, aside from the thick grass, there's like saplings, there's, there's thick stuff. So like, would you, are you interested in just a string trimmer or like something with a blade on it? Or both, some, some combo? Probably something I could interchange. Like, that just depends on the heads. And they, these mowers are real nice, but they're also worn. They've been used a lot before they ever got to either of us. And another, another, another thing than the potential wish list if anyone wants to donate <laughs> is, uh, oh, maybe a nice mower, like something like a 33 inch something. Uh, I don't, yeah. we don't know that Honda makes anything that large. Uh, if, if there is a, a Honda product like that, that would be cool. We know there's a Toro time cutter, stuff like that. But honestly, any, anything that would just help pr productivity and be reliable and can deal with the depth and thickness of grass here. Yeah. If anyone does want to donate, yeah. use, use the uh, PayPal pal address that I provide below. And uh, I'll give you a shout out on a future video if you do so. And if I have anything set up to where you can donate, I'll, I'll just... Uh... Maybe, you can, maybe include that, but yeah. probably just send it his PayPal. Well, well yeah, if, if he comes up with something, we'll include that too. Um, also, check out his channel, Matt D, which we'll link yeah. below. It's not as near as entertaining if you like tractors, but, uh, you know, it's, hey, that's, it's different. That's the thing I haven't really talked about. Uh, so, like, although I post the motor repair videos and small engine repair videos periodically, I never really talked about... Uh, what's behind it and um, I'll do that in an upcoming video but it's actually kind of a fun side thing for me and I'll, I'll elaborate that on that later. See ya. See ya. <laughs> so what's your favorite food? Nothing there. You got White Castle, Skylon, oh. tacos, Right now, I'm hooked on cheap quarter, cheap quarter Raymond, <laughs> boiled egg whites, and some Mrs. Dash spice, and Bragg's amino acid soy uh, sauce alternative. It's cheap, but it's good. I might get some White Castle. Might even do Skyline again. Definitely doing UDF again. Uh, Sam's Choice Pizza from Walmart and Philly Cheesesteak. Woo! Like five bucks. Bing Cubs. Uh, that thing is so good. That's better than any pizza you can buy from Domino's or Pizza or anywhere. Sounds magic.